welcome back to my channel. It's Jazzy and I'm back on YouTube, guys. So today I'm filming a really cool video for you guys. I told you I'm going to start on my nursing journey and filming some more nursing content. So to start off today, I'm going to be showing you what I have in my lab bag. Uh, it was just really bad, so no matter how far into my nursing journey, I won't be able to say it's falling because I was crammed with stuff. My own understanding. So Okay. So today I'm going to show you guys what's in my lab bag. So I've been starting again with labs and uh, we're not allowed to bring a big backpack into our labs and for my first like two labs it took me a little bit to realize what I really needed for my lab and I realized that I could take in a tote bag because I remember I would get there in the morning, put my stuff away and have like all this stuff in my hand like my textbook, my notes, my iPad, everything that I have in my bag and it was just falling just I was crammed with stuff so I learned that I could definitely bring a tote bag and so I have my little tote bag here so this is the little tote bag I take into my lap this is the nurse life uh, bag this is what I got um, so this is my little tote bag here that I take into my labs this little tote bag I got during nurses week at the hospital the nurses were so sweet to give me one because they know I'm becoming a future nurse so thank you my ladies so inside is all the goodies and you'll see that's pretty heavy and this is why I had to definitely get a tote bag and stop carrying all this in my hands because it was just everything was just falling off it was just really bad so I learned and I got organized and we live and we learn right so before we dip into this bag I just want to let you guys know that I have an exciting announcement at the end of this video so please keep on watching I'm really excited to announce this so keep on watching till the end of the video to see why I'm so happy okay so we're gonna dip in okay so in my tote bag first things first is my stethoscope case so I got this off Amazon and what I love about it it actually holds my sphygmometer sphygmometer blood pressure cuff <laughs> I still will never be able to say that uh, word no matter how far into my nursing journey I won't be able to say it but in my stethoscope case of course in my stethoscope I do have a litmin I don't have any of the fancy colors, boo, but I do have this gray one and she does the trick nicely. So, um, not every lab I go into I need my blood pressure cuff, but I do like to always have it on hand just in case, um, you never know. Um, next is my lab kit, so for my labs they make us these little lab kits. Um, in here was my blood pressure cuff, that's why I was like... The bag seems really small, but inside I have like my blood pressure cuff and they give you like a little case, but I decided to move it into my stethoscope case. But this is our just little lab kit that they give us for every lab, and it just gives us everything we need to get through our lab and to practice at home. Um, next is obviously our textbook. For my labs, we use the Jarvis um, Physical Assessment, oh my god, the sticker on here from my first <laughs> week of labs they made us put name tags on but these guys do not stick to your scrub so I've been coming home and finding them like stuck to everything <laughs> um okay but yeah so we, I make sure I take my lab manual and um this just has questions and everything according to our labs and to practice at home um so yeah this I definitely take in as you can see I have my little stickers on top to organize next is a must have I cannot live without these I have actually several different kinds of these but these are the file accordion file organizer things you can literally buy them at the dollar store but it just it's so easy to have all the papers you need for lab um so for our lab like we have sheets that our teacher gives us sometimes there's also documents that we have to print like examples to take them into lab um they also i have like my own notes here to help me with lab um and then sometimes they ask us to have like certain documents like that we have to have ready to go and to help fill to fill out and practice at lab. So I always make sure that I have that in here. This has been just a must for me and it's just helped so much with holding everything together. Um, it was at a point where everything was so just messy. And um, it took me a while to figure these things out, but definitely this is a must if you're going into your labs. Grab yourself a little accordion file organizer. So I don't have much in my bag. That's why this is not going to be a very long video. But lastly is this little case here. 
I got this case at the dollar store, like, I want to say three, four years ago. Um, I bought it for my iPad, and I never really used it until now. Um, I will try and find some dupes for this on Amazon, or we'll see. I'll try and find something similar for you guys. But this is, like, a lifesaver for me of just keeping everything together. So, um, they're trying to teach us... To stop using a lot of paper uh, because things in the hospital here are going to be turning very virtual and online soon so they allow us to take in our iPads on our iPad and maybe I'll do a separate video of what's on my iPad but on my iPad this is a very old school iPad she's been through some stuff but she's still working um, I have like my classroom like my Moodle um, I can also get textbooks on here. I have notes. Um, I also like I have a file folder in here where I like download all the documents that are in that file organizer are also in here. Um, just so I have two copies because I'm a person that like I love my iPad when it comes to just reading. But when it comes to anything else, like actually having to document, I have to write with a pen because that just helps me retain information. So I always have both with me. Um, I'm a little much, I'm a little extra, sorry. But uh, yeah, so that's why I have my iPad as well. And it's just nice to have because I have my Jarvis lab manual because we actually do work in that, we actually have to write. But my textbook is in here so that well, when I'm in class, I, can, I don't have to carry a big hunk in textbook. It's in here. Next in this little bag. So this is my little red book and I have um, been, been like preparing it for when I go into clinical. I just summarize all my courses in here. So this is health assessment. Um, I've just been doing this so that when I go in clinical everything, everything I need is in one place and it's in my own language and my own understanding so that when I go into clinical it's all in one place. So I have have like doing my introductions, all that stuff. Um, terms of direction, all that. So I, I've been updating this with every course that I do so that when I go into clinical, this it just is going to be almost like my little black book. The next is this little pouch here. This is all the good things. I have all my highlighters, pens. Um, I have a stylus for my iPad. Any sort of pen is in here. Sharpie, this is coming in handy. I have my pen light in here. Um, next in here, um, this is a must because I'm really bad when it comes to charging my iPad and my phone and just because my life is very chaotic, I always make sure, so this has to get recharged, but this has like, this charges, this holds so much power, you guys. This is from Miniso, Mini, Minoso, it's um, I think I, I want to say it's a Chinese owned store, um, they have, they have a whole bunch of stores in Canada now. And I bought this there when they first opened and came to Canada, and it's lasted me that long. Like, I've taken this camping and charged my phone, like, four times. Like, it's unbelievable. So I always have this in there with this little charging cable so that if I get to lab and I didn't charge my iPad, I'm not surprised. So that is always a must for me, and it's nice to have, but I am going to have to go charge it. I have my school little ID badge, and on the back here I have like some health assessment, like conversions, um, blood draw, health assessment, um, and then of course the one that everybody has is the pain assessment chart. Little badge, I have my little stethoscope cover um, as well, I didn't want to use the <laughs> colleges. Um, I have my own, but I'm actually thinking of changing it to Cookie Monster. I'm just not loving the stethoscope. I think it's boring. I'm going to spice it up a little bit like I do for work. In here as well, I have headphones because sometimes I'm stuck at the college for three to four hours in between my classes. So if I don't want to take my laptop, I can just watch some of my videos or anything like that on my iPad. So I have this. And it also works with my laptop if I decide to take my laptop. I cannot forget this. This is my nurse pinup watch. Um, I got this off Amazon. I did buy one from the college for my first lab and like the watch, like the clock itself, it just completely stopped working. Like I went to go get the battery changed and they're like, well, this is broken. Like they changed the battery. It just would not start. And I was just like, eh, I'm just going to buy one from Amazon. 
Yes, so I have this, and I also have like an extra battery in here just in case. So if I get to school, there's no surprises. So this is not what's in my lab bag, but I didn't want to show you guys this because it's helped me so much in labs. So one is these big scrunchies. I have such long hair, and in my labs, they do not let me even put my hair in a ponytail because if I go do assessments and my hair comes forward, that's not okay. So I have to completely have my hair back. So I love these big scrunchies, and also these headbands with buttons. So these ones I got at Claire's, I believe, but you can also buy some on Amazon. I have like a whole collection of these. This is a Baby Yoda one with buttons. What I love is that you can put the mask on here. So um, we do wear masks in our labs. This is I like these because you put these on, it keeps the hair completely out of your face. And I love headbands that go over my ears. I don't ever like putting headbands behind my ears for some reason. Um, so then I don't have to worry about always like lifting my headband to put the mask on and off. It just has these buttons that I put it on. So I love these. These have been so helpful in work and in labs. So if you're doing your clinicals or your labs right now, you really want to get some nurse headbands with buttons. Um, I will definitely let you know down below, link down below, um, my favorite Etsy shops that I bought some from. I'm excited to announce that I am launching my own scrub brand. <laughs> yes, everybody, I am going to be launching a scrub brand. Um, the name is Blue Sunday, so please uh, stay tuned for that. Support me as much as you can. I will give you guys more information when I can, but I'm so excited because we will be launching some scrubs. We will also be doing these cute shirts. This is actually one of the designs that I will be selling. Um, it says I love you but with hospital like a stethoscope a needle and an IV bag so this is an idea of what we're going to be selling on our site. So yeah I'm so excited to be announcing Blue Sunday so I definitely hope that you guys subscribe so that you guys know more about that and I'll be sharing more on that very soon. Um, saying that, that's everything that's in my lab bag. So I hope this helps you guys, um, especially future nurses or you nurses going into nursing school. So I hope that um, this gave you guys a little bit of an insight on uh, what to take to your lab and to help you get organized for those labs. Um, if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel because there are going to be more videos coming up real soon. Um, definitely some more nurse related content. And um, definitely comment down below any videos that you guys want to see or any video ideas. Um, please let me know and I will get on that, okay? Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys!